as well. And his opponent, from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing 267 pounds, Mr. Mayhem, Wardlow. An amazing athletic specimen making his way to the ring, but, but Chris, I want to get your reaction to MJF. What's wrong with this guy? He's not fooling anybody. What are you talking about what's wrong with him? He's obviously suffered a devastating injury, and we wish him nothing but the best here. Uh, Inner Circle sent us some flowers earlier this week. And when you talk about devastating injury, Tony, look at this guy right here, Mr. Mayhem, is gonna inflict some devastating injuries on Musa standing there in the corner. Uh, look at Warlow, if you're gonna create the perfect pro wrestler, this would be him. If you're gonna train him in a lab, Warlow would be what you wanted. Wardlow staying focused, staring right at Musa the entire way. Look at the traps, the biceps, the pecs. What a gigantic man. Full turn to the referee, and here we go. Earlier tonight, Cody's advanced to the championship. Who will he face, either Lance Archer or his brother, Dustin? Oh my God. You see that right off the bat, Musa runs at Wardlow, and it's just like hitting a freight train. And a pretty good looking one too. Look at this guy's face. He could be on the cover of, of Big Muscle GQ, Tony. Big Muscle GQ, he's a handsome man. I, I, I will have to agree with you on that. And he is just assaulting. My God, Musa in the corner. Yeah, he puts that giant shoulder. It's gonna go right, out of the, right outside the back of Musa with that loincloth. Tears loincloth right off to that shoulder in the corner. He's just tossing him around, ragged on him like Steven Tyler. What is it about loincloths that we've been seeing? I, I don't know. It must be the fashion trend of this part of the country, and that's why all these idiots accept these matches against Wardlow. What are you thinking? Why would you accept this match? I know you need a job, uh, Musa, but how, you're gonna do a job, is what's gonna happen. Oh, watch out. Put the brakes. Oh, look at that! Paint rushing the big guy. Face to face, look at this. Wardlow's laughing at him. You, you don't take, you don't take, oh, look, a very athletic move here by Musa, knocks the big man to his knees. Did you see that, Tony? Didn't even leave his feet. Yeah, one knee, he just got down to one knee that time, and I think he's, just, oh my God, he caught him up, punch wow. out, into the corner. There's no give in those corners either, Tony. They call it the turnbuckle pad, but there's no pad there to speak of, as Warlow just grabs this man by the throat. What's he gonna do? Points down, gladiator style, oh! oh. Did you oh see my that? God. My God. He could have crushed Moose's face. Paul Turner was checking in to see if he's okay. Oh, there's no way he's okay after that. He's never gonna be okay again. He could have lost his nose smashed, orbital bone broken, and Wardlow's not done with this man. This is, this is an assassination, Tony. Well, we have seen the airplane spin before. Let's see if that's what he uses here. Look at it. Oh, he just ragdolls him down. End this. Paul Turner should end this already. Enough's enough. One, two, two, and three. three. Came there. Finally over. Thank goodness. You know, Tony, I'm, I'm a nice guy, as you know, but I, I, I didn't want to see Musa take any more punishment. Wardlow just winner. decimated this man. Wardlow. How can you stop this perfectly created genetic monster?